So if we look at labor market inclusion, I would say we have two challenges in, in Norway. The first one is that uh, Norway has what we call a, a trust-based economy, uh, which also can be translated into a net network-based economy, which means that it's actually hard for outsiders to get into the business ecosystem. Now, if we compare that to uh, Germany, uh, well, America, of course, uh, we we would see that the, 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 the value of a local network is higher in Norway. And that hinders, or that's a challenge for migrant founders in, in Norway. Um, yeah, I would say that's the main challenge when it comes to entrepreneurship. Um, we also have an issue with refugees where we, we where you are sort of you're placed around the country so you will find very high skilled uh, refugees uh, in a mountain district with no jobs uh, and you will find low skilled migrants in an area with just high skilled jobs uh, which means that our uh, labor participation rate if you take away educational schemes is not as good as uh, our, well, as Sweden, which is the country we normally compare us with.